It is often said that cats are independent and a bit proud, or that they only love themselves. It is also said that cats are more attached to their territory than to their humans. Not so. Anyone who lives in contact with these luminous beings knows how far from reality this preconception is. Studies have shown that cats are just as attached to their owners as dogs and that they love them just as much. In fact, scientific research concludes that our cat regards us as its parents. How can we, in turn, show him all the love we feel for him? Here are three ways to give your cat love, and above all, to show it. 1. Say I love you in cat language, squint your eyes. If you want to show your cat love, you might as well say I love you. How do you say it in cat language? Here are the steps. Wait until your cat is relaxed. Choose the moment when he looks at you. Look at him gently, then squint gently, let a little bit of light pass through your eyes and stay for a few seconds. Gently open your eyes again. You can do this several times in a row. This is a sign of love and trust in cats. You've probably seen your cat do this when it looks at you. At that moment, your cat was sending you this love. A study has confirmed this translation of feline non-verbal language. Indeed, scientists from two universities, Sussex and Portsmouth, in England, published their findings in the journal Nature on the 6th of October 2020. Squinting is a gesture of affection. So the more you do it, the more you will strengthen your relationship with your pet. 2. Respect your pet, respond to its requests for a cuddle, but don't force it. Sometimes, some humans miss out on their cat because they don't respect their pet's rhythm. They don't respond to their cat's requests, but cuddle it when it hasn't asked for anything. However, it is the opposite that will allow you to prove your love for your cat. A cat that is respected feels completely at ease. When your cat asks you for a cuddle, don't let this opportunity pass you by. If she lies down on your computer keyboard, for example, don't shout. Gently hold her and give her the cuddles she asks for. If he chooses to lie on your work tool, it is precisely to capture your attention, so it is the moment to respond. This way, he will know that he can count on you when he needs to be close. When it comes to cuddling, a cat knows how to show what it likes best. Generally, the cheeks, chin, the space between the ears and the back of the neck are their favorite areas, but every cat has its own preferences. Some cats like to be stroked on their lower back, while others hate it. The same goes for the belly. So listen to the signals he sends back. When he stretches his head or reacts with a sign of well-being, you can continue, but if he moves or changes position, do not insist. The same goes for when you try to caress him and he flattens out under your hand so as not to be reached, in this case, postpone your caresses to a time when he is more available. 3. Feed your cat well, choose quality food. A well-fed cat is a happy, peaceful and confident cat. Choosing quality food means your cat will benefit from good digestion and a more robust health. So avoid supermarket kibbles and pates. The low prices are possible because of the poor quality of the ingredients. Often many grains are added because they are cheaper than meat, but they can contribute to increased digestive and metabolic disorders. Occasionally, small healthy treats such as freeze-dried or dehydrated chicken will make a happy cat feel pampered. Remember to respect its needs. In general, unless there is a particular pathology such as obesity, bulimia, etc., Cats are nibblers and must be able to access food continuously, as they do in the wild when they hunt birds and mice.